Hey guys, how's it going? It's Max Fisher here from A Better Universe. It's Workout Wednesday, and I'm not going to be doing a workout with you guys. I'm sorry. I apologize. I know it. That's not really setting a good example, but due to time constraints today and the fact that I still will work out three times today, well, yeah, it depends if you call yoga a workout. I consider it a workout because it gets me sweat and it hurts my legs. It makes them sore, so it just really depends on what kind of yoga you're doing. Anyways, I'm... I'm digressing that's not really the point so today I want to talk about the importance of having a healthy body of working out of getting that nutritional balance in your life now um, for you those of you that want to work out that have something that needs something that come here for this Wednesday workout so that you can get a little something that you don't have to think about I recommend downloading the app down dog I am not getting anything for this promotion guys this is just where what I do when I do my yoga I don't feel uh, um, I wouldn't say it. all right I feel as though I get a better yoga experience and I learn more every time when I do it through somebody coaching me and down dog just happens to be a great app for you guys it's like super cheap twenty dollars a year maybe the free version is great you i mean it'll give you everything that you need and again i'm not getting anything from this promotion i just think it's a great product and i think you guys should at least try it so moving on past that healthy body guys we got to have a healthy body we got to have a healthy mind we got to have a healthy energy to us but um part of it is having that healthy body that you know, whatever you do in your body, your mind will follow. So, if you energize, energetically balance and energize the body, the mind will follow. You have all these, um, getting a little more esoteric into it, but you have all these um, nadis. They call them nadis all over your body. Like little, uh, where if you look at an acupuncture flow chart, it's those little pinpoints all over your body. And when you exercise, when you work out, when you do yoga, especially, it's aligns those nadis, those energy centers in a certain way so that they're optimized, they're really feeding, they're really taking in all that they can get. So uh, that itself will bring you a newfound and profound amount of energy. A lot of people just say, I don't have the energy to work out, I'm tired after a day's worth of work, I'm tired after this, that and the other thing. I get it. The reason why you're tired is because you're not working out. If you guys are trying to save energy for tomorrow, you're going to just find out you have less energy because you're one day older and you did nothing to progress yourself forward. So don't ever try and save anything for today, guys. Always give it all and you always find out you have more tomorrow. Same thing with the body. If you're sore, if you're tired, if you ran a marathon and you just, you know, feel like, okay, I can take today off. I can, you know, take a little bit of a rest. No, guys, just keep going. Just keep striving. Just keep working towards your goals. I mean, yes, there is a certain amount of rest, but... If you take your uh, body into your own control, if you learn it, how to perceive it through your yoga, through your meditations, how you learn the awareness of it. There's a, a certain amount of control that you can have over the healing process and over the breakdown period and how much tension and energy you expend in a workout. And um, you can drastically decrease uh, the amount of time you have to work out, the amount of time in your recovery and all such things. So keep that in mind. That's very important. Um, healthy body guys and I mean come on you if you don't feel good you don't perform good and that's like big part of it guys I rarely 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 get sick I just feel like I never get sick and honestly I feel like that's because I push my body to the limit I work out so hard I detoxify every day through sweating uh, through my twist and my yoga through whatever whatever be a source it is I feel it guys it's important it's it gives you a different, a new profound look on life when you have this kind of energy, when you have this kind of vitality and strength and endurance and you can just see more and do more and be more and, and sleep less and uh, it's just, you got more to give guys. You, you, you learn and you grow and you build your mental fortitude through these workouts and you learn a little bit about yourself sometimes and it's just, it's, it really is amazing the uh, profound effect that just having a healthy body brings to the mind and the clarity and uh, how it feels you know it, it's all about how you feel sometimes you know sometimes you can't even express things in words so I can't even tell you what what the difference is really from when I was there to now like I can I can say the words I can I feel better but that doesn't really, I feel amazing okay but that doesn't explain the feeling it doesn't explain the 
sensations, the profound energy that I have, the driving gut force. It doesn't explain that, guys. So it's sometimes it's all about how you feel. And if you work out, you're gonna feel better. And when you feel better, you perform better. And you guys, you can get after your dreams. You can have the time and energy for your kids to play with whoever, whenever, not get tired, maybe. I don't know, those kids got a lot of energy. You probably get eventually tired, but I mean, at least you'll last a little longer. At least you'll have a little more fun doing it. You probably won't be in as much pain. I mean, it's great to get moving. It's the number one age reducer. It's the number one uh, cancer reducer. It's the number one um, heart failure reducer. It's a little bit of exercise, guys. It it's, has so such a profound effect. The endorphins that it releases in your brain, the serotonin and dopamine that it dumps in after a workout is great for your mood, great for um, depression, getting rid of that. You know, uh, guys, I don't think I have to go on any longer, do I? I've made my case. If you guys need more evidence, it hit me up. I'll, I'll write a whole entire book on why you should, you know, why you should be a healthy fit, why the body is so important in this process. A well-developed mind is great. A well-developed energy is amazing. And you can do a lot with a well-developed mind. And you can do even more so. Uh, you can transcend the physical with your energy and your emotion. But you're here in this physical vessel. Once you're done meditating, once you wake up in the morning, once you open your eyes, come back, whatever. You're still in this physical body until you die. So why not make it so you can experience what you've got right here to its fullest extent by making sure that you're the healthiest, best, most vibrant part version of yourself that you could possibly be. All right, that's my spiel on it, guys. Down Dog, check it out. I apologize we're not doing our, uh, our little workout Wednesday like normal. For those of you that have uh, been with me for a while, you know I, I never miss it. So uh, this is an anomaly, and uh, we, won't make it, uh, we won't make this a habit for sure. All right, guys, keep crushing it. 30-day challenge is coming to a close. You yeah, get after it, guys. Max Fisher here from A Better Universe, your mind, body, spirit connection. We're getting fired up on Fridays. Stay tuned.